Welcome back to my channel. On this video, I'm just gonna take you with me because we're gonna have our first ever surgery in my entire life. Uh, wisdom teeth removal surgery. And um, it will be number 28 and 38. And I chose to be sedated. So they're gonna put an IV sedation uh, as soon as I get there at 9 o'clock. We're here now at um, Shiloh's daycare. Um, dropping her off and then Mark will drop me off at, um, at the dental clinic and um, Manlang family will pick me up after the surgery um, Mark wasn't able to get it um, as a day off um, kind of sucks but it is how it is um, we just need to do it because I already booked the off at work and um, everything is all prepped up um, so yeah, just come with me today and do not forget to subscribe to our channel and give us a like and comment down below and share as well to your friends if you can. And we're finally here. I go to Pinewood Dental Care to have my teeth cleaned. Here's where I go to have an oral exam and everything that has to do with teeth. We're here, so I'm just gonna show you what I'm wearing. I'm just wearing a headband so that my hair doesn't go to my face. And a very stretchy long sleeve inside with this vest and this teddy jacket or whatever you call that. And some jeans that's very comfortable. And my shoes. So we're here now and we're just gonna wait for someone to let us in. So I'm in the reception area right now. As soon as you come in, they will just screen you. Like they still do the COVID screening until now. I did this in April. And also, um, this is where I go to like sign all the paperwork. They sent it to me before this appointment. So I already read them. And I went through them, so I'm just here to sign them on their machine or whatever your signature um, machine or whatever you want to call that. I don't know what it's called, honestly. But yeah, I'm just signing all the paperwork right now, and I'm kind of nervous, as you can see. I am moving a lot because <laughs> it's my first surgery, and no one's there with me you know what i mean but i didn't really needed someone to be there for me as well oh, so yeah yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes Okay, so now I'm just bringing up the, now they do have a chance to read over the consent forms. Yes, I did, uh, but I wasn't able to pick them, so I was going to sign them yeah, here. Um, yeah, all we do is send them so everybody can read them. We'll yes. get you all and sign in the office. Okay. Okay, so right now I've got the IV sedation consent form up. Mm -hmm. So I'll get you to sign that one. Okay, so I got that 
So just have a seat and I'll be able to get you shortly, okay? Okay, thank you. Just wanted to quickly show you how beautiful this clinic is. Like, look at this clinic with that plant wall. So nice. Everything is just so nice. You feel like you're in a spa or, yeah. I felt like I was in a spa actually, but yeah, it makes me feel so relaxed. You know, I just love going here. the Wi-Fi. So many plants. So beautiful. And then when we walk here, you'll see the photos like of everything. Okay, well, two to three days is mm -hmm. really going to be the big time, okay? Yeah. Dry socket normally happens five to seven days after. Mm -hmm. um, normally found in the Okay, so we'll try to work. <laughs> so Perfect. that's good. Yeah, You'll just follow the instructions, okay? It goes over, basically. Mm -hmm. I read to you. So, like, mm -hmm. awesome. So you've already... No drinking from a straw. Anything mm -hmm. with that sucking motion is not good, okay? Mm -hmm. When you got home and you're hungry, anything cold is good, nothing hot. You okay. want that blood clot mm -hmm. to work. So those are the two big ones. When you're home, you want to be elevated. So have some pillows behind you. Mm -hmm. Prop you up. We'll explain this to Ronnie when he needs to up as well, okay? Okay. But we don't want you flat back, otherwise that can get the bleeding going again. Okay. okay? And then, yeah, just That's keep it. this with you. We'll okay. go over I'll everything and fix you up as well. Thank you so much. Okay. You're welcome. And yeah, we're all good. Like I said, we'll be up in a moment. Okay. Yeah. Thank you so okay. much. You're welcome. <laughs> And I'm going to go find your fat question real quick. Just give me one moment. Okay. okay. So you put a little bit of that material in each tooth here. Just a tiny little bit. That's for the whitening. That's for the whitening, yes. You put it in your mouth. Mm -hmm. You run your finger just spreading material. Okay. Keep it for about an hour to an hour and a half. Oh, an hour to an hour yes. and a half. Okay. Take it out. Rinse your mouth. Rinse the tray and you're done. Okay. 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 Obviously, before you do that, you have to brush and floss your teeth. You yes. don't want to be putting that on your dirty sure. teeth, okay? Yes. <laughs> so, basically, that's all it is. Okay. If your teeth become sensitive after the first use, yes. please stop until they feel normal again. Okay, okay? for sure. Mm -hmm. So, if your teeth are fine after first use, you can use as many times as you'd like, as long as you still have the material. Okay. Or, if you're satisfied with the outcome. Okay. Whatever comes first, okay? okay? thank you. Okay. So right here, I just have my nurse, Brian, that will do the IV sedation on me. Um, just getting all my information, making sure they're correct. And I was just showing you my whitening trays. Um, you get a whitening tray, uh, of course, with the whitening material for free. If you get a full oral exam, I did mine in 2021. But I didn't have the time to pick them up until today that I'm getting my surgery. So that's why I have them and they were giving them to me now. But they've been sitting there for months. Um, so yeah, so Brian here is just getting all my information, getting me prepped up. So before the dentist comes in, everything is all set. We're doing IV sedation on you today. Okay. Have you ever had an intravenous starter before? No. Okay. So it's a very small needle that goes here, somewhere in your arm. Okay. Um, and then we administer some medication to you to make you feel very relaxed so that it makes this procedure possible for okay. going to hospital, okay? Okay. Um, you'll be breathing the entire time on your own. Mm -hmm. It's not like we put you on life support or anything like that. Mm -hmm. uh, but the medication is, is used to sedate you. That's why it's called sedation yeah. dentistry. Okay. okay. Um, you, have you ever gone through surgery before? Never. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. After all this talk with Brian, I wasn't able to vlog anymore because it's not allowed and I didn't want to film them like doing the surgery on me as well. This is the waiting area. Um, this is like their 
like it's a very relaxing area to wait for your ride and my ride is there as you can see and we're going home now they're gonna drop me off at home thank you so much manlang family um, for picking me up and dropping me off it was painless like no pain at all so i highly recommend this clinic it's a bit more pricey than the other ones but definitely worth it the service everything is excellent and uh, yeah there you go guys uh, thank you for watching this video and my post-operation surgery was all good no pain with all the medications that i got as well so there Jesus, please take care. Please take care. Ninang Angel, please heal her. Fast. In Jesus' name. Amen.